Floaters are little spots or strands in your vision that you may see uh, floating across your vision. And they're particularly noticeable when you move your eye around or look from one side to the other. Floaters are caused by opacities or condensations in the jelly of the eye. So inside the eye, there is a vitreous jelly similar to egg white inside an egg. And just like how egg white can develop little strands inside it, uh, the same thing can happen to the jelly inside the eye. And this is usually related to aging. The other cause of floaters includes a posterior vitreous detachment or PVD when the jelly comes off the back of the eye. In most cases, floaters are not dangerous. The exception being is if they're associated with a tear in the retina or a retinal detachment. Your eye doctor will have checked this for you at the time that he or she sees you. However, if you suddenly notice a sudden increase in flashing lights in your vision, lots of floaters in your vision, or part of the vision going dark, with a peripheral shadow in your vision, you must contact your eye doctor again as soon as possible. In most cases, floaters by themselves do not require any treatment. And in many cases, they will subside or become less noticeable with time. Occasionally, some patients will have ongoing floaters but as long as the symptoms don't increase suddenly, these are not normally a concern. In some patients, they have very severe floaters which affect their day-to-day -day living, including their ability to drive or do the things that they want to do. In this case, treatment of the floaters may be required, and this may include things such as laser or even occasionally surgery. For very bad floaters, these can be removed by an operation called a vitrectomy. A vitrectomy is an operation where we remove the jelly from inside the eye and that jelly is then replaced by saline or a salty water solution inside the eye. The good news is that removing the jelly does not normally have any bad effects on the eye. It can, however, cause a cataract if you have not yet had cataract surgery. A cataract is when the lens inside the eye becomes cloudy. Vitrectomy surgery is usually done under a local anesthesia, and it's a day procedure where you don't have to stay in hospital. Most patients who have surgery for floaters notice a substantial improvement in their symptoms, but it doesn't guarantee that all the floaters are completely removed. Whether you should have surgery for your floaters is a decision that you need to make in conjunction with your eye doctor. And this will depend on how bad the floaters are and also what your visual needs are.